Um, it is Monday. I am starting off a new vlog this week. I haven't done like a true weekly vlog in a while and I am committed. I'm committed this week. We have a lot of fun events going on after work this week and so I wanted to vlog and I'm committed. I'm telling you this right now. I'm, I'm gonna do it. Um, so this is like a week in my life working. Um, today was a pretty hectic day. Um, I was at my parents' house this morning because I had a dentist appointment and it's way closer at my parents' house than it is here and I wanted to make sure I could like work and stuff. So um, I worked up until my dentist appointment. How my dentist appointment? I do have one cavity so I have to go back next week, um, which is not fun, but you know, it is what it is. And then I went to Trader Joe's on my way home. Um, and yeah, let me show you what we got. Also, I love that it's still so light out and it's like the evening. That is, I'm living for it. I'm excited for March. I'm excited for spring. Having a great time. All right, let me show you what I got at Trader Joe's. All right, this is what I got. Not too much because I get HelloFresh now, which I absolutely love and we'll be making a meal in a little bit. Um, but since I have so many like vendor events and stuff this week, I really didn't need that much, but I need like a couple extra snacks um, and just a little bit of things because I only have like a meal and a half really three meals left for Trader Joe's, not Trader Joe's, HelloFresh. So this is what I got. First things first, they had some beautiful tulips and I figured it's March, I wanted to get some. I do need to buy a vase though because the vase that I have is like very skinny on the top and it just doesn't work. So I'm gonna buy a new vase tomorrow. Probably should've done that today, but that's okay. Um, I got some broccoli to do like broccoli and rice. I just got a dozen eggs. I really don't go through these fast, so I got a half dozen, not a dozen, I lied. Um, I got some lemons, because a lot of recipes I do always call for lemons, so I always just like to have them on deck. Oranges, I don't know why, but I've been absolutely craving oranges lately, so I got a big boy bag of them. Hopefully they would keep me not sick, because everyone's getting like allergies and stuff right now. Not that oranges are gonna help, but maybe they will. I've also been craving potato chips. I know it's bad, but sometimes you just need a drunk night snack, and this is going to be it. They also are like, there's nothing in there. There's literally potatoes, sunflower oil, and sea salt, so I don't feel horrible about eating those. And then I got some more brown rice. I've been also craving these chocolate lava cakes. I've been doing really good, but sometimes I just crave chocolate, and I need some, so I got these. I got some butter because I feel like so many recipes I do also call for butter. I probably should have got two of these, but one will do for now. I also got some of this vegan pesto. Um, this just sounded good because I have some pasta that I need to use up. So if I need an extra recipe that this week, I can use that. Let me see when this expires, though. Oh, literally in April. We are good then. Um, I got some chicken parm with marinara sauce. I like to eat this at lunch um, at work, so I need lunch this week, so I got that. Um, these are new. They are the oat non-dairy frozen dessert sandwiches so i'm pretty excited about these another little treat to have because every once in a while i just i'm like i need something good and that will be it um and this is also just something like super easy it's a drunk food and then also it just it's good so just frozen pasta um i also got some random stuff from target literally tampons pads um my cellar water because i was out and then paper towels as well because i was almost out honestly you guys really good tip for target because if i go in i will buy things i don't need do the target like pick up drive up like you literally just drive up and they hand you your thing it's so great i use it all the time like after work there's a target by my work so i'll just drive up quick grab the stuff i need and it's perfect i don't even have to go in the store they bring it right out to me it is amazing love it and it's free so love that that's all that. I'm going to put it away quick. Um, oh, I also got this dress I wanted to show you guys from Nordstrom Rack. I went with my mom um, yesterday. And this is, I don't know, I just thought it was really pretty for spring and summer. Um, it hits like kind of right above my ankle, so it's like a little bit longer. But I have a couple of weddings this summer. Surprisingly, lots of people getting married. Um, so I thought that this would be something like perfect for that. Because I think they're all outdoors, so we'll see. Um, but yeah, I love it. And it fits really well, too. And just is... It's a cutie little dress. I love it. And I can even wear it at work um, and just put like a little jean jacket or something over the top if I get cold. So, love that. You guys, I can't get over it. It was very gloomy. Like yesterday, last night, it snowed. Um, and so you can still see there's like a little bit of snow, but it really it was like a dusting. So, I think it's supposed to be pretty nice the rest of this week. So, I'm sure it will all be gone by tomorrow. But, 
I'm letting my plants soak up some sun. My plants are doing pretty well. That one's always done well. And I moved this one over here because it, it's not supposed to get like direct sunlight. So I don't really know where exactly to put her at, but she's there for now. This one is here. I feel like this one is like, it's like curling, which usually means like it's like lacking something, but it's supposed to be in direct sunlight and it gets direct sunlight like all day long. So I don't know if it needs more water, less water. I have no idea. Let me know if you know what I should do. But that one is honestly thriving. It's so nice. So that's what's happening. Monday night ended up not really being a good night um, and I just went home to be with family the last few couple of days so um, I'm back in my apartment for a couple of days and then I'm going back home um, but I just wanted to come back here one because there was a snowstorm it's not really that bad actually they made it out to be a lot worse than what it is but I need to come back I had like packages and stuff um, and I have like food and stuff that I need to throw away or take back to my house so I'm gonna go back home next week, but for now, um, I just got a package, so I wanted to show you guys um, what I got. It's from Princess Polly. Also, the new packaging, so cute. The first thing I got are these pants. Um, they're just like trouser pants, black ones. Um, I really like them. They are the Archer pants in black. They're something that I can wear like out, I can wear at work. Um, they're just very in right now, so I liked those, and everyone really likes them too, and so they have them. And I also got a new pair of jeans. These look kind of small on the top, so hopefully they fit. Um, these are PP denim. <laughs> it's literally like PP. I'm a little confused. Maybe it's DD. Um, these are the organic cotton blend. Menorca mom denim jean. I really like them because there's no like rips so I can wear them at work but then they have like just dressing at the bottom so I'm gonna try these on. They're a little bit lighter wash than what I normally go for but I like the material. They kind of feel stretchy so they're not like legit jeans probably. I don't really know. So let me try those on and see how that fits. These are what the jeans look like. They're cute. They are pretty comfy, and I like that the zipper goes up all the way. I just feel like that looks more flattering typically from the side. I will say though, they kind of give me a little bit of like a pancake booty, which I'm not a big fan of, but they're comfortable. I like the length, um, and they fit, which is great. Okay, and then these are the trousers. Sorry, I'm like tucking up my sweatshirt so you can see them and they don't just like drown. It is like quite dark in here though, that really didn't help much. Uh, these are the trousers. They are like a little bit long, but it's kind of the way they normally look. But I think if I just wear like high tops or something with them, that's a little bit higher. Um, but yeah, it literally looks like I'm wearing a dress. Like you can't even tell that they're pants. Um, but yeah, they have pockets. They're actually extremely comfy. Like they feel like pajama pants or something like that. So I like them. They'll be cute with like a little crop top. And I like them from the side. I feel like they look good. So that's the second pair of pants.
guys it is monday um i just got off work not too long ago and i had a pretty productive day yesterday i got a bunch of groceries from trader joe's so i'm gonna show that to you guys in a little bit it's really not that much at all but just thought that you know i would show you um and then i also have some packages so i'm going to show you those the first thing i just wanted to show this because i got this from amazon i think it's so cute and i did a little unboxing video on my tiktok and it's also posted on my instagram which are always both linked down below so you can see the rest of the stuff i got but one of the things i got was this i think it's so cute the colors are super weird like they shouldn't look weird on the camera but it's like the super colorful little like journal and i really like the journals that are like have prompts in them because i feel like that's just helpful for me because i like to have prompts because sometimes i just don't know what to journal about i don't want to like journal about nothing i also got this blanket this company it sent me it's le gear i think it's l-e-g-e-a-r so le gear cooling blankets i'm really excited because i always love the cool side of the pillow and i never even thought about the cool side of the blanket so i'm pretty excited for this they let me pick mine out Ooh, it like kind of feels cool it's like one of those things where I'm like i don't know if it's like a placebo type of thing where it tells you that it's cool so you just think that it's like cool but it's not actually but this like it feels cool so i would assume it's legit but let me get this open so i can show you guys what it looks like It's like 80% nylon, so I guess that, that probably is why it feels cool. Okay, this is what it looks like. That'd be cool if you could like set a temperature. Like that is a thing. There's like hot blankets, you know, but why is there not like cooling blankets? Maybe I shouldn't buy one. All right, it's a pretty big one. I didn't know a color to choose, so I got this like kind of neutrally color. I feel like that would go with a lot. I can definitely feel it. I think one side is supposed to be cool and one side isn't. Like the back is cotton and the surface is nylon maybe. It's a pretty big blanket though. I will say it's like very soft. Like it's like a like a jersey cotton kind of material. Like kind of like a t-shirt material and it does. Ooh. I wonder if it gets more cold like as I take it out of the packaging. Like this side is pretty cool and then this side is more just like the I think it's like the cotton like this must be the back the cotton and then this is like the nylon surface it's cooling Ooh, i will say i like that this will be nice like in the summer when it's super hot outside today it's like a little bit it was a cold honestly it was like 70 degrees but it was just like rainy but this is nice wait i kind of like this you guys it is cold <gasps> wait that's so weird I love that. I don't know why, but I always like whenever I'm sleeping to like have something kind of cool, especially to like lay on like that. I might actually really like this, especially in the summer. This is so nice because I'm always like you come in and you're literally so hot and this could just cool you down. Well, still, you know, sometimes you still want something covering you. It's nice. This would be even nice like outside, like an outside blanket. Ooh, I like this. This is definitely nice too if you, I think a lot of people get super hot at night and this would be lit to have. Or even like hotel rooms a lot of times now, for some reason, they keep making them so that you can only go below like, you can't even go below 70. And I don't know about you guys, but I like to be cold when I'm sleeping. I think it helps me sleep better. Bring this. It will cool you right down. Wow, I'm excited. I might use that tonight to sleep and see if if I get better sleep because I don't know if that's like a scientific proven fact, but I think as you get older, you like it to be like cold when you sleep. I know a lot of people that like that. So this is cool. Oh, it shows like a whole, the cool touch technology. It absorbs the heat to keep cool. The nylon and the sweat like is on the other side. Skin, whatever. Interesting. I will link this down below for you guys. I think it's super cool. And let, who doesn't love a cooling blanket? All right, next thing I got is from Parade. Um, I am now a Parade ambassador, which I'm really excited about. Um, I have gotten their underwear in the past, and I really like it. It's just good material. I love their branding. They're extremely sustainable, um, and they also just really preach like body positivity. It's like one thing to preach it, but it's another thing to like actually have body positivity and to have like just I don't know show love for all people of all sizes 
all skin tones, all shapes, colors, like whatever. I really like it. So their packaging is super cute. That's it. Their branding is just like adorable. I really like it. It's like retro. It's your parade. And I just got to pick out a couple of things. This is so soft, you guys. What the heck? They had a lot of like very colorful stuff. Like they were out of a lot of like neutral colors, which I would normally wear. But I thought that this was like so cute. And you guys, the material, it's giving skims. And I, I'm not going to lie about that. Like this material is so soft. I love that. Like this would be so comfy. I could like wear that to bed. I like all their stuff is like recyclable as well which I think is really important. And a lot of brands don't do that. And like, think about how much packaging, how many online orders they have. Like another company, Princess Polly does that too. Like everything is like recyclable or made of recyclables. So that's really cool. And then I got these loungewear joggers. I really like the color. It's kind of like a neutrally brown color. And like I said, just joggers. Look like they might be like low key short though. I can't tell. It might just be the way it looks. But these look super comfy as well. I just wanted some cute like loungewear stuff. So thank you Parade for sending us. This stuff's so cute. I'm actually low key so excited for this bra. And then I just ordered some bodysuits from them today as well, which I'm really excited about. Cause I hope that they're like this material. It's so soft. It's incredible. And then part of the package I should have started with first is my HelloFresh box. And I'll put my code for HelloFresh on I buy this literally with my own money, not sponsored. I genuinely love HelloFresh so much. I think it's awesome. So I'm going to put all of this stuff in the fridge. Okay, let me show you what I got from Trader Joe's. Um, first things first, I got these two guys up here. The Shell House Mango Spiked Seltzer Water. And then I also got Ranch Water. Wanted to try them. They both sounded good. Um, I got these Olipops at Sprouts. I just got like two of them. I love, 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 love this flavor. Um, I just have all the rest of my poppies. I recently tried this one. I think I was scared of it because it had ginger in it. But I tried it while I was at home this past week. It absolutely fell in love with it. Literally, it's so good. This one and then also the strawberry lemonade or just strawberry lemon are my favorite flavors. They're so freaking good. Um, I also got these at Sprouts as well yesterday. They're just the Harmly, Harmless Harvest um yogurt i really really like this um i got some eggs um what else i got oranges i've been obsessed with oranges lately apples and lemons and then there's also some blueberries in there just some broccoli normal this chicken is hella fresh and then this is like chicken sausage been loving these i don't know why i'm just obsessed and then i also got another butter because pretty much every recipe i make from hella fresh has butter in it so i got that and then also the vegan um, kale, cashew, pesto. And then I got quite a few frozen things. I got a bunch of these. Um, they are like zucchini, banana, like muffin things. Those are from Costco. I just stole some from my parents. Um, I got these gone bananas and then I also got the strawberry ones as well. I got more rice because I just run through it so fast. Um, lava cakes, but I think I got those the last time I went. Um, and I think that's it. I think the rest of the stuff I got the last time I went to Trader Joe's like two weeks ago. My freezer is very stocked. Like, a couple weeks ago I had like nothing in it, but we restocked on some items. And then we have pantry. Um, I got this blueberry muffin mix. I just like never eat breakfast and I need to start doing it. So I got those to make. And then also this brownie mix. So sometimes you just are in the mood for brownies. And then I also got this Carbone pasta sauce. Because I have some like pasta. So Fusilli, if I ever want to make it. I got this Carbone from Sprouts as well. So I'm excited. We'll see if it tastes like Carbone. And that is what I got from Trader Joe's. I almost forgot my favorite thing I get from Trader Joe's is tulips. I just got some flowers this week. Um, they look a little rough right now because I totally didn't take them out of like their packaging yesterday so they definitely needed like water um actually now that oh it looked literally i got this from amazon as well it was in that same package with that book back there but it is so beautiful like i love the detailing on it and it was so hard for me for some reason to find a vase so i finally found these ones but since it's so like dreary outside they're not like perking up like they normally do like when they see the sun though they sit literally like, straight up and will open up but since there's no sun today they're just kind of a little gloomy a little sad so it's making me sad, but that's okay. Um, and then I have a literal mess. Like, I feel like my whole apartment, like, there's just, there's a bunch of boxes over there. Like, I, I need to clean. But, like, it's so hard because I just don't want to. I think the first thing I'm going to do 
No, the first thing I'm gonna do is clean up my my living room because it will take me like five seconds, literally a minute. It will not take that long at all. And then I'm gonna take a shower because I just feel like gross. You know, I was in a coffee shop today and my hair, I hate this, but my hair like soaks up every scent it's around. I feel like delirious right now. I don't even know why. Just <laughs> having a great time. Okay, so clean living room, take a shower, and then I'm like not hungry. So I might make dinner in like a couple hours, but it's only like 6 p.m. So maybe I'll make it later because I need to get lunch. For tomorrow i do not have a lunch so that's the plan san let's get it hello guys so i have a couple of pr packages that i wanted to show you guys so first one is from bondi sands looks like this how cute and they just sent me the well they sent three different products a treat a treat, a hydrate, and a mask. So the treat is the Thirsty Skin Hydrating Hyal Hyaluronic Acid Serum. I literally cannot talk today. Um, let's open this up. Ooh, all their packaging is also like so cute. Like, I don't know. I just think that that is adorable. So got that. And then the next product is the Daydream Hydrating Whipped Moisturizer. Just looks like this and then the last product is a mask and it is the Bondi babe purifying clay mask and that looks like this I'm really excited because this has blue spirulina in it so I'm assuming that it is actually blue I don't want to open it up though because I'm scared it's gonna like get blue stuff everywhere and, yep a little tint of blue to it which is so cute so those are the products that i got i'm so excited to try these out so they just came out with their skincare so check them out pretty cool and super cute packaging was is always what gets me i love the packaging and then my other package is from parade check out parade as well they have really cute stuff they're very inclusive as well which i love um just overall literally an amazing brand so excited about that now for the rest of today um i need to do some editing photos and videos and then i don't know i need to make some dinner i have a ton of hello fresh meals coming i'm about to make myself some lunch and then get started on the rest of my tasks for the day so Let's make some lunch.